All right, welcome to another episode of Insurance Sales Truth, yeah. baby. JVH in the house. You yeah. guys know Jacob Van Hilden, the Telesales Tycoon. All right, I'm going to talk about something a little different today. We talk about Telesales a lot. On this episode, we're going to keep it real. We're real. going to grill him, baby. We're going to the dirty, dark secrets yeah. that no one else finds out. We're going to find out. All right, so right now, I want to ask insurance recruiting. What is, give me the worst experience you've ever had recruiting an agent like the absolute worst like bad like like this dude or this female was awful you hated it you and, and then you recruited them anyway well see my my favorite people are the ones who promise you the world yeah hey i you know 10 years ago i was the top producer i was putting up 10 million in premium every year and <laughs> i want to come in at the highest level possible even though was. even though i haven't produced in yeah. the last you yeah. know 15 years and th those those individuals are are a little more difficult to work with just because right. they you know they expect they expect the world and they expect right. the world from you but they don't want to really give anything back um True that. but the the ones that are really difficult are you know the, the, those guys first of all but the ones who don't understand I mean the bad the, ones the just the guys that you just scumbags you just want to just <laughs> you just want to beat the freak out of them Jake well uh, you want you want to you want all right we'll move on okay so next question like recruiting why is it that most agents don't produce why is that i mean you just brought it up but it's so prevalent it's it, so it common is. what's the deal there I, I think it's just a lack of, of conviction i think it's a lack of actually understanding what it takes yeah. to be successful because this is not a nine to five job what are these agents that are watching what do they think about recruiting because everybody wants an agency everybody wants to build a downline everybody wants to recruit Co e even i have been recruiting and building a downline in an agency for 27 months now yeah i failed at it for 21 months yeah i didn't give up why is that i mean well it, the biggest thing that 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 i think agents have to realize is that in order to bring interest in you have to be the one who's who's doing it you yeah. have to be in the you have to get your, your boots dirty you got to be in the mud you've got to be doing it because lead by example exactly if, if you don't know how to do it yeah. how are you going to show other people that's how to do exactly it? when our when our business started to take off is when i started to get in the actually give back mm -hmm. yeah actually started to help these agents yeah. actually tried to give them leads actually tried to give them videos actually started doing ride-alongs yeah actually started showing me being successful what, what's the one thing about the insurance agent the insurance business that you hate the very most I mean that one thing where you're like dreading to get out of bed and get to the office because you just hate it I, I think I think it's just like I said earlier it's the, those agents who who want everything from you but are not willing to give anything back yeah and from a recruiting standpoint if you're trying to build a legitimate downline of agents who are actually producing they're all looking to the top. They're all looking yeah. to the top for leadership. And if leadership doesn't know how to produce, then how in the world do you expect your downlines to produce? All right, dumbest thing you've ever done in the insurance business. I mean, stupid, oh, you're like, God. gosh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Too many to count. Uh, I, I've walked away from a lot of opportunities, haven't haven't asked for the business, haven't asked for the referral, haven't asked for... Hey, what about when you're making a telesale? You had a chance to close this person and you gave them an out. You said something dumb. I. The, the first probably two or three weeks of me really, really being in the telesales world, I don't think I was strong enough on the phone. You know, I would mm. let that first no be the did answer. They, did they have control? The, and they did. They did at the beginning. Yeah. They did. And once I realized that I was, I was losing money yeah. because I was letting them control the conversation, that's when it, that's when it right. ended right there. Speaking to all these agents, give, give them the truth. Give it hard. Insurance sales truth. Let's finish with something. JVH, spitting game at these agents. If you want to recruit a downline, if you want to build a successful agency, you have to build it around yourself. You have to be the anchor. You have to be the foundation. You've got to be that that sh bright shining star that when everybody looks up they can say okay this guy knows how to do it and I want to learn how he does it. I love it. Insurance sales truth. Thanks for watching. Awesome job, JVH. We bring, we keep it real. We bring the heat. We grill them. We get the dirty seekers for you. Get ready for next episode. Click subscribe for me right now.